truth props. Well, the first thing I did was I went and searched um, some images on my computer. Okay, so I found this set of mouse ears. I turned up the brightness on my iPad, just plain copy paper on top, but I'm gonna use a marker so that you can see it a little bit um, better. You gotta hold your paper as tight as you can to it. Zoom it in, and then I'm gonna draw on top of it. Here's my nice little quick sketch. Uh, and so you can see now that I have this nice little set of mouse ears. And so you can do this for a whole bunch of stuff. In fact, I found um, some images uh, to go with this. So I've got Donald's hat, so we have Goofy's hat, and I found some lovely green paper. We're just gonna do this with a pair of scissors. I've chosen this blue paper for uh, Donald's hat. And I'm just gonna go through and cut out the larger shape. The, th the little tag here is actually hit black, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut that off. So uh, here's my hat, but here it is now in the blue. Well, I'm gonna put it back on for a second and cut out that last little bit of the blue. I've got in um, black poster board. You want it to be nice and stiff and stand up. So um, here's my black poster board and here is Donald's hat. I still want to get his uh, flag there and the other part of his hat in my picture. So what I'm going to do when I cut it out is I'll cut out this in black as well as the cap part of it will be in black, but you can kind of see in this that I'm going to leave this edge of black all the way around. So you're going to want to get a dowel rod or two, get some wire cutters and cut them into smaller, a smaller piece. So I'm going to do about a third. And so these are what wire cutters look like. Clip it. I would recommend, so you see it came off there. DIY Mickey Mouse photo booth and hopefully I'll be posting pictures on my Twitter and Instagram so please follow at Izzy Inc and also check out IzzyInks.com for other tips, tricks and things. I hope you guys have a great day.